Go ahead, the turbo. Okay. Yep. And so pick up the guard for the turbo. Yeah, plan three nine gallons, ten for ground. Okay. Three, just yeah. hold it down for about three seconds. Seven to three zero two one. Three three VF. Three, three good to go. Yeah, eight. that's yeah. all. Three, nine, now we're waiting for a white light to come on in the front. There it is, sapphire, right? Got it. Okay, we're just going to hold on another five seconds. Pick up the guard now for the engine start. Blue one. Blue one. Got it. And when the RPM starts to move. You'll release the button. Go ahead and push it down. Okay. <clears throat> when the RPM starts to move, release the button and bring the throttle to idle. Moves. All right, back to idle. There you go. There you go. <clears throat> Perfect. 24% she should light. And when it lights, we should get 420 degrees. There's light. There she is. Okay. Number one is at idle, right? That's going right to idle. That brings us to the after start. All switches in the top row on the right side, bring them all forward. All switches at the top, coming forward. And the second row also, bring them all the second forward. row, coming forward. Very good, that's it. Third row we don't care about today. Fourth row, engine triple gauge, right? Hydraulics and voltage. This is all normal. Okay. Battery voltage is normal now. And hydraulics should both be normal. Correct. Yeah. I want you to select the middle flap button for middle flaps. Middle flaps. I'm going to close your canopy or get inside. Copy that. Don't leave, uh, don't leave without me, okay? Copy. Lock it up. Lock it right here. Good. It's locked. Alpha 24189, Santa Fe Ground, runway 33, taxi via Alpha Charlie, cross 28, uh, 10 minutes 3021. Going to 33 for 189. Okay, I'll take us out of the parking spot and I'll give it to you. Tap it. So I'm going to depress the lift and I'm going to gently pull on the handle. And you can feel every time I pull it, it tightens up, yeah. doesn't it? So I just pull it very slowly. Okay. So just hold the brakes, right? And uh, go ahead and bring the throttle full forward. Don't hesitate. Push it right to the stop. Full forward. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, EGT is normal. Vibration gauge is normal. Put your attention outside. Just release your brakes. Away you go. There she goes. Look at that. Good. Gently. Gently. Good. Okay. All right, you got rudders now. Just use your rudders. Okay. There you go. Very pretty. Airspeed alive. Very nice. We'll wait for 100 knots, and then you're going to rotate to a nice 10 degrees, just nice and gently. Right about there. And rotate. Gently. Landing gear handles in front of your left knee. Coming up. Wind 350 at 10. Runway 330. Gears up. Good for takeoff. 338 And hold the stick real loosey goosey, right, so you don't induce anything into it, right? Yep. And when you're ready, go ahead and hit the zero flap button, the brown button on the left side. Flap to zero. And hold 10 degrees. Good. Okay. And do a couple of turns, get the feel of it a little bit. Oh yeah. Yeah, coming right. Let's go ahead and start off by doing a couple of, uh, oh, let's go ahead and do our stall. Go ahead and pull the throttle back to 85%. That's right. Okay, 85. Yeah. And now just pitch your nose up about 15 degrees nose up. And we'll just uh, bleed off a little air speed. Then. Is that 15? Yeah. Just hold that. And when she uh, starts to break, you can just add full power and just lower the nose just to the horizon. Copy. Just 
stick shake. There she goes. Attention all aircraft. Information Romeo. Burned on Santa Fe TIS. Wind 350 at 1-1. Just pull the nose up to about 20 degrees pitch up. Okay? Release your back pressure and give yep. us left stick. Okay, now you felt a lot of negative on you there, right? Yeah. You push that stick forward, right? Ah, yes. So just leave it wherever it is. Let's try one more. Go ahead and pitch your nose up. Back up to 20. Good. Release. Okay. Now, no negative. Just push it left. There you go. Much better. That felt pretty good, huh? That was way better, yep. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, I want you to pull the nose up 20 degrees this time. Go ahead, 20. Good, even 22. Pull it up a little higher. Okay. Release your back pressure. Take your time. Roll us upside down. Not too fast. Yeah, keep rolling. There you go. Stop it and roll us out. Good. And no more than three G's as you bring the nose on up. Jeffy. Beautifully well done. Very, very nice. And you're okay, so I've got the airplane. I'm going to go roll this upside down and give it to you. Okay? You have the airplane. You stay on the controls if you like. Okay? I'm just going to pull this on up. Roll this on over. Okay, your airplane. My airplane. Good. Very nice. Nicely done. Nicely done. All right. That looked great. Thank you. So now we're going to do one from level flight. I'm going to roll the airplane upside down. The nose is going to dish down pretty good. Okay. And I'm going to give it to you. You're going to pull the throttle back and then roll us out. Okay? Copy. I've got the airplane. You have the airplane. Your airplane. My airplane. Throttle back. There you go. Very nice. Very, very pretty. Very pretty. Got it? Excellent. Good. Your airplane. My airplane. Back to 95? Yeah. Copy. When you put the nose down about, about 10 degrees down, even 15 is fine. Yeah, just degrees. push it forward. Yeah. 10 or 15, right? We want to get uh, that little Mach meter to close to 0.7, right? You see the Mach meter open up now? I do. Okay. And we're looking for traffic. Everything looks good. Keep pushing it down. Coming up on 0.7. Okay. Put us in level flight. There you go. And trim it. See how much forward pressure you need now? Yeah. Yeah. Just trim it for level flight. Uh, 12,000. See if you can hold around 12,000. Okay. Good. About right there. Yep. Now you see she's pitched down more than it was when we were at normal cruise, isn't it? Right? Yes. It's way down here now. Nose down even a little bit more. Okay. Now go ahead and start a right turn. See how it feels. Oh, yeah. We're doing 420 knots true. That's pretty nice, huh? Nice and tight. Yeah, but they got it. Yeah. And now just for the hell of it, pull back with your fingers a little bit, see how easy it is to pull cheese. Yeah, Go ahead. Cheese to <laughs> yes! Oh, I love it. You need to go to that one five also and go over those other trucks around? Four. Uh, all the runways over to the new Pretty nice, huh? Beautiful. All right, pull the throttle back now to 95%. Copy. Left turn. Okay. And pull about 3 G. Right. Yeah, that's good. Right there. Oh, that's nothing. Right? Now, let's just see how close you came. Take a look at the G-meter. Is it showing three on the red? Is there a red tick by the three? Oh, uh, no, not enough yet. Not enough? Let's okay. try one more. Sure. All oh, yours. You're coming right. There she goes. Good. Keep that. Can right. I go to four? Sure. All oh, yours. It's more than four, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. There you go. Very Beautiful. Nice. Very nice. Very nice.
Okay, have you looped your Cetabria? Nope. Oh my goodness, you want to loop this thing? Very much so. All right, go ahead and make a left-hand turn. Okay, we're good here. When you're ready, give us 103% power now. Okay, 103. Uh, and we're going to tighten up our leg and stomach muscles before we enter the loop. <clears throat> we're going to do this in a couple of stages. The first stage is to get 340 knots. The second stage is to go to level flight, okay? 340 so, level. Yep, yeah, and she, is she trimmed pretty good for cruise? Was she trimmed good for cruise? Yeah, she was. Good. Leave her to trim where it is. Don't mess with it. Just okay. put the nose down now about, oh, about 10, 12 degrees. And we're looking for 340 knots. <clears throat> I don't see any traffic around here. We're good. Three hundred. Good. Coming up on three forty. All right, put us in level flight. Good. Hold that for just a second. Okay. Now I want you to tighten up your abs and your leg muscles, right? Yep. You can still breathe and just look straight ahead and a nice easy pull, no more than three and a half G's, okay? Copy. Just ready. keep your attention outside. Go ahead, pull back. Ready, go. No more than that. Good. That's a good pull. Very nice. Now as you're pulling, look to the left and just keep pulling. A little bit. Good. Very nice. Good. Now look back over your head at the horizon. Got it. Here you go. Don't pull back too hard. Okay. Back to the top. We're slow. There you go. And let it. the nose fall. Good. Very gently at the bottom. You're going to pull back to about three G's. Right about here. Copy. Pull in three. Pull, pull, pull. That's good. You're good. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah! All right, make a left-hand turn away from our uh, restricted area. You're good? You're, yeah. you're just fine. Beautiful. Thank you, sir. Yeah, you're good. All right, pull the throttle back now to, uh, let's go way back to idle. Just bring it back to idle. Come out of turn, fly to the vortex, then plan straight in for 33. I'll come here 3019. All right. The vortex and straight in. Three zero one nine on. I guess we can go ahead and start descent now. Go ahead and pull the throttle back to eighty five. And you're descending at one hundred forty nine. Twenty nine. The citation traffic's now two miles. You got him picked up yet? No, I don't. But I'm looking. Oh yeah. Okay, I got him. I'm sorry. We're gonna be closing in on him here. We'll make a little left hand turn. Well, you can do a little approach at about sixty nine hundred feet if you want to do that. We'll do that. Low right, approach out spawn. Number two, follow the citation jet. Clear for restricted low approach out at about 6,900 feet. You got it. Yeah, we'll do a little, quote go around here, right? You got that citation in sight? I'll be here shortly 500 feet. Uh, I think so. Yeah, I got it. No yeah. problem. I'm sorry. Yeah, I just continued to send you. Okay. We get down to 7,000, you go full power and you'll clean it up. How's that? Copy that. Still a little slow. And how about an overhead brake for 189? 189, that's approved as requested. Brake left. Uh, Go full power up. right now. Pull the gear up. Gear up. up. And hold, uh, hold this altitude for just a second. Okay. Flaps up. Flaps up. Thank you. The proper climb us to 8,000 right over the airport. We're going to do a military style approach. Hell with this guy. <laughs> there you go. You're doing fine. Just climbing to 8,000. Up to 8, Turn right at uh, Alpha. Hold short of the correction. Turn right at Golf. Hold short of Alpha. Give way to that uh, 650. They're coming your way. Once he passes that point, then you can uh, make a right turn taxi on the end of the Okay. Right here at Golf. Short of Alpha. Give way to the 6. Coming up on 8,000. Just hold I'll talk you through it. Got and tell 189, you want us to break left or right? Break left. Left hand brake. Left hand brake. Uh, departure okay? That'll be fine. Good. Hold what you got. Copy. Now you're not having any fun now, are you? <laughs> I've always wanted to do a break. Okay. So here's what you're going to do. Right in here, go ahead and bring your throttle to idle. Okay. Start a left hand turn. Okay. And hold your altitude about 45 degrees of bank, no more than that. There you Copy. go. Yeah, we don't want to get too close. There you there go. go. 45. And just climbing. keep coming around. That's fine. There hold we go. 85 degrees of bank. Just three, keep coming three, around. Two land. Keep coming around. There's land three, three. Right. right out to the downwind leg. There you go. Okay. We're below gear speed, right? Uh, yes. Below 180. Gear down. Gear down. 